Hello everyone, it's me again, GW Fan the Softcore Brony, welcoming you back to Let's Play My Little Pony Fantasy 6. So today I'm way over here on the world map. I'm uh, going to Neche or Neche, whatever. Yeah, I have a very particular reason for coming to Neche right now. Uh, interesting thing about Neche. Oh. Yeah, Neche isn't exactly a town anymore. It's a, more of a dungeon. Uh, I'll be going up that way soon enough. But, uh, yeah, so for this place, I'm taking this team here. And I'll be using Fluttershy soon enough, soon enough. Uh, I just, I didn't want to uh, end up using a team of Twy, Fluttershy, and Pinky multiple times. So, yeah, I had to kind of change it up here. Besides, this will work for me. So, yeah, this is how we're all uh, set up here. Uh, I've got my uh, fire rubies for what I got in the uh, last episode. And uh, I've also got Dash with the Holy Avenger because it's more powerful than the White Lance, even with the uh, a little uh, extra damage that Lances get. Uh, I guess I really haven't... I kind of glossed over that. But, uh, yeah, anyway, first of all, you know, the town's almost deserted. You still got the classroom here, magic bucket of happiness. You can still learn stuff if you still need to for some reason. Anyway, I'm going to be going over this way first. Alright, red eyes. These guys have no particular weaknesses, but as long as we got Pinkie Pie, let's uh, test out, check out some of her new abilities. Woohoo! Meteo! BAM! Oh, I got lucky on that one. Great damage all around, but it has only about an 80% accuracy, so it, it tends to miss fairly often. Oh, Twilight and Haste. Okay, cool. Interesting thing about uh, Neche, uh, every single random encounter in this place is affected by level 4 Flare, so if you have Rarity or Faust, uh, they can one-shot everything. It's great. <laughs> oh. Oh, Mag Rotors. I don't believe these guys... Yeah, these guys aren't weakening us anything either. Uh, let's try out another ability here. Gilamantis! This will not be enough to kill these guys. I already know that for a fact. Shrapnel! Non-elemental damage to all enemies. Or one enemy, if you want. I believe it suffers from split damage as well. It's a pretty good ability. Much better for Faust, though. She could, she could probably do... Uh, I don't know, maybe in the two to three thousand range right now, honestly. Probably more in the twos. Alrighty. Yeah, nothing that impressive about Mag Rotors, really, I don't think. No, not really. Alrighty. I guess they, what, they know, like, some ability, but whatever. I don't care about it. Oop, not up that way. Ah, Nastodon. You know, you'd think... Oh, let's get a Pinkie Pie again. Where is it? Towards the end there, right? Yeah, there it is. Senior Behemoth. There we go. Fire 3! Alright! You know, you'd think that being pretty much being the game's only ice area, that everything would be weak against fire. But, no. That ending right there, the Nastodon, that's the only enemy uh, in the area that's actually weak against fire. It's kind of odd. All right, nothing over to the uh, right there, so we're going to go this way. All righty. Oh, I remember this place. Ah, Psychot! The enemy that defies everything, that defies the uh, logic of the area by being weak against ice. Makes no sense. Pinkie Pie... Actually, I did learn Ice, too, with her, but whatever. Shrapnel will do the job, I think. Actually, will it? It might not. Oh, maybe it will. Cool! Nice pinky. Yeah, I don't really need to use uh, Cat Scratch around here. It's a lot more crowd control necessary. Ah, Wizard. Another interesting enemy. Uh, we can get Thunder. Ah, oh, you jerk. Oh, okay, but... Uh, are we good? No, apparently we're not. Oh, currently we are. Oh yeah, and I have 
try a crit with the Thunder Shield purely because she still needs to learn Bolt too. Ooh, that's what I was hoping for. Trixie learn Flare and Break. All right, I don't really know what else I can teach Trixie at the moment. She kind of knows most everything else except for what Palador. Yeah, so I'm gonna switch that. I need to start her. Oops. I need to start Twilight on Bahamut as soon as I can. I plan to have her done with it by the time I get out of here. Uh, hopefully. Alright, I got Flare and Break now at my disposal. That'll be useful for uh, later. Alright, and we're going to go down this way. And up here. Remember this area? You know, something I forgot to mention about those wizards. They have a common thunder rod steel, a rare ice rod steel, and they can drop fire rods. So it's the only way to get those three particular items in the world of ruin. Hey, all the scootles are gone. Except for one! Scoot! Uh, you know, technically you can't fly either. Oh yeah, you know what? Uh, uh, I said back back when I got uh, Faust that you know she's one of two characters that uh, do not start at the party average. Scoot technically is the other one. If you didn't recruit her in the World of Balance, and this is the first time you see her, then uh, she'll be five levels ahead of whatever your party average is. All right, Scootaloo. If we had only three party members, she would have been uh, uh, put straight in our party, but, uh, oh, I lost the music. Oh, well, yeah, but, uh, I'll get her in my party soon enough. So, yeah, and here we get the Scooter, replacement for the Moogle Charm. Uh, I don't think it has any stat boost or anything. It's only for Scootaloo. Scoot past enemy encounters. Essentially, you will not get in any random encounters while riding the Scootaloo, uh, the, the Scooter, scooter. <laughs> yeah, while well, riding the scooter, which is pretty cool. Essentially, you could go to uh, any of the uh, dungeons in the game and do an early treasure raid. Uh, speaking of which, I'm not going to do. By the way, I'm I'm not going to use a scooter at all. Speaking of treasure, remember I left this here back in the world of balance. Uh, it was a ru a rune blade before, if I recall, and now it's a freaking blue ribbon. <laughs> Heck yeah! All right. Oh yeah, the one thing I like about the scooter, it lets you sprint now too. That's kind of a cool feature. All right, and up there is just where we basically were, I think, right? Uh, let's see, down here, another treasure I left behind before. It's now an elixir, all right. He's doing a good job of killing everything. Here's the other treasure I want. I definitely want this one, the pod bracelet, all right. This, oh, it's already there. This uh, casts auto safe and auto shell. It's for every pony and doesn't have any extra effects there. Uh, it would be useful, I suppose, except that I already have rainbow bands, which do all that and then some, and some stat boost, then some. But the pod race is still useful because uh, I can use it, or not use it. I mean, I could bet it at the Claudesium for a hero band which I'm actually going to do right now, as soon as I get out of here. Yeah, I'm just going to... I think I can warp out of here, right? Yeah, as long as I'm right here, I'm just going to warp out. Except, do I have one? Yeah, I do. Ah, oh, I can warp out. All right. Let's uh, change up some stuff and get going here. All righty. I... Uh, yeah, I, I traded in that, that pod bracelet for another hero band. Uh, I didn't really need to show it because I just fought the Hema fight again. Just use Rainbow Dash. It, it always works. Yeah, I've got Scootaloo in my party now. It choose at level 28. Very cool. Actually, that's also kind of under the level there, too. Anyway, I've got her equipped with the White Lance because she can't equip the whole Avenger. And uh, Snow Muffler, which will be useful for later as well. Anyway, uh, oh, I might as well heal up real quick before I get in the darn door. Test Rider, who I believe is weak against poison, but I don't really care. This Is that good enough? Eh, you know what? Let's use Toxic Trot, just because. All right, Poison Oak! 
kind of a unique skill, actually. Uh, there's only, like, one enemy in the whole game that uses it. Or maybe two. Oh. Well, she can't actually use Ice 2. That was from the Ice Shield. And try to learn Bolt 2, so I can change that up. But uh, I don't really need to at the moment. Cool. So, yeah, let's heal up real quick. And I like that music. That's really good music. Alright, so we're going to go through the town now. I guess I don't need to change up my uh, shields or anything right now. Actually, is... Oh, Pinky is equipped with the ice shield. That's right. Anyway, unfortunately, almost everything in town is locked. The only things that are not... Uh, that are not locked are uh, that uh, building with all the house with all the treasures in it and uh, and Arvis's house. And Arvis is not there, by the way. Uh... He's not in the game anymore. Apparently he died or something during the World of Ruin. Yeah, I'm just using El Nino and Gila Mantis's shrapnel to kill everything off. Together they just... You know, I just realized that I kind of uh, overlooked what uh, Skulu was talking about uh, when I recruited her. Apparently there's someone around here who's been looking after her. So, yeah, I wonder who that could possibly be. Yeah, we're pretty much done with new encounters around here. Although, I will be showing off one more random encounter in this area for particular reasons. Oh, one right around here somewhere. This one, in fact. Oh, it's these guys again. Oh, no big deal there. Uh, let's go ahead and have Scootaloo. Scootaloo. Soar. And jerk. Uh... What do I want to do? I'll have ice too. Because I don't think those guys absorb ice. Do they? Well, just in case. Let's back it up with Gila Mantis. Well, two strikes is good. So if it doesn't take out him, then Gila Mantis will. Oh. Oh, she's zombied! Oh, man. Oh. I didn't realize I could do that. I never really paid them much mind. Well, darn! But we mastered a new dance. All right. And, uh... Yeah, let's just... find that Revivify where I know I've got some in there somewhere. Wow, what did I get so many? Oh, yeah, I've been collecting them because of, uh... some of the enemies around here. Anyway... Now we finally have the last one. Icy Frolic! Uh, sort of like Watery Waltz and Toxic Trot. It's a multi-target ability primarily. Not so great against uh, bosses or individual enemies, but good for crowd control. Yeah, all three of these are really good for that, while the other ones are all good for bosses. Although this one's a little different, but I'll discuss that uh, later. Anyway, Trixie, you want to kill yourself there? All right. Uh-oh. There's a dragon wandering around. Well, let's uh, re-equip ourselves real quick, and I'll be right back. Alrighty. Well, before he uh, comes down here, here's uh, here's my uh, new setup here. Uh, uh, ice protection all around is very good. Uh, you could use more than just the one wall band I have if you have uh, a better, mu uh, like some multi-target spells or something. Or you know, fire two actually would work pretty well. But well, yeah, fire two. You know what? Hey, come back here. Because he's the Ice Dragon! Alright! First things first. Cast this on... Haha. -ha. Do that. Now you can't... Where is it? Mute. Cast that on Twilight. Because this guy, as you just saw, has auto wall. And what am I looking for? Muddle. Yeah, and we don't want that. We don't want him doing stuff. And... Fiery Ballad! Alright, and then just straight cat him, would ya? Oh, well. That works. I'll have to redo dance though now. Darn it. Aya! Alright, and I've got Flare, which I'm gonna give to you. Dance, please! Fiery Ballad, do it the, the better way this time. Go ahead and use Muddle on yourself. It's a, basically the best that Twilight can do in this situation. 
All right. Come on, Scootaloo. Let's put the heat on this bitch. Ha-ha. <laughs> because that eats through wall and does tons of damage. Yeah, little known fact. Well, maybe not little known, but Scootaloo actually makes a really good Dragon Slayer in this game for pretty much all but two of them. And yeah, Muddle doesn't have 100% accuracy. Ha-ha-ha. <laughs> no. Twa's got Bahamut, but I'm going to wait off on it for the moment. Actually, I should probably start getting another mute ready. Now, this guy obviously is weak against fire. He also is susceptible to a ton of status effects uh, poison, mute, berserk, confusion, and slow. But, uh, there we go. That's why. <laughs> yeah, there we go. That's the second one. Uh, a second one back there after you kill him. Crazy. Uh, yeah, he actually only has uh, 52,000 HP compared to all the other dragons that has 65,000. The uh, reason I... Uh, that's why I wanted Mute first, and yeah, he can throw stuff now. Did I just cast Mute on Trixie? I really hope I did not just cast Mute on Trixie. Well, it doesn't matter because twice frozen. Goody. Darn it. Yeah, for, yeah, there's nothing you can... Oh, oh, that didn't last long. Yeah, there's nothing you can really do to protect yourself against Freeze there. Let's get some life... Some... Oh, crud. Life going there. He's gonna kill us all if we're not careful. With that freaking revenge ability. It would have been better to get Mute off as soon as possible. Wow, I don't think I've ever had two... Ca I did cast that on her. What was I thinking? I don't think I've ever had more than, than one character dead at a single time. Man! Well, I just feel silly now. Um, yeah, let's just, uh... Let's get Scootaloo back up instead, because he's pretty harmless now. Alrighty. Well, now that I've thoroughly screwed myself over. Let's just... Well, not really screw myself over. Yeah, now that I got that, uh, that, that silliness out of the way... Uh, where is it? Fiery Ballad, please! But yeah, this guy is one of the th of three dragons that is seriously crippled by, uh... Sour mouth, but I don't want to use poison, uh, or I don't want it to be poison, because at the uh, current time, at least, uh, if he dies from poison damage, uh, his second form won't show up. So I guess really I could use it now, but eh, it's good. We're at them pretty good doing damage like this. He's almost gone. Oh, that was embarrassing back there. I can't believe I cast mute on Trixie. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, go scoot! Bam! There we go. Yeah, no sour mouth needed. Let me get ten magic points like always, and two magic shields because there was two of them. I didn't want to have only one magic shield. I have plans for that item, or at least one of them. All right, six dragons left. Uh, let's go ahead and get you with uh, one of these just so I can walk fast again. And yeah, that's fine for the moment. I'll be re-equipping shortly anyway. Yeah, I'll just leave them like this for the moment. And we got a save point there. I Actually, I should probably use Osmos soon. Oh, well. Hmm. Let's see. This guy's still here. Let's uh, re-equip real quick, and I'll be right back. Alrighty. Uh, not much change there. Oh, by the way, I have Scoot with the Demon Lance because it has one more magic point over the uh, White Lance. Uh, yeah, no wall bands needed for this. Hey there! Boom! Alright, once again, he's weak against, uh... Yeah, let's go ahead and... Ah! Well, what am I thinking? I'm not worried about ice. More Fiery Ballad. You can just use... Flare, which I think should do maximum damage. And then, just... Summon old Bahamut there. And then follow it up with uh, Strike Cat, and you should go down pretty darn quickly. Well, that was pointless. There's no reason to do that to Scootaloo, especially with how little you took away. 
Ha! <laughs> we got ice protection, and that didn't even do that much damage, even for ice three. Wow. Yeah, he basically nullifies every element except for fire and ice. He absorbs uh, ice, but yeah, he's weak against fire there. He should go down pretty quickly. Oh. Well, apparently that was, uh, almost useless. Okay, never mind. I guess I should have used magic after all. Oh, well. I got him anyway. <laughs> Good going, Pinky. Good going. That was a really strong fire spell. Holy crud. Maybe get seven magic points. Yeah, we weren't trying to kill you or anything. <laughs> oh, he's been in there for a thousand years. <laughs> All right. And we get the Tritouch Magicite. This is the main reason I wanted to come to, uh, to Neche as soon as possible. Whoa. Well, before we investigate that, yeah, this is a great Esper here. Tritouch, Ice, Fire, and Lightning, three-way attack. That's cool and all, but what this is the really important thing. He teaches fire, ice, and bolt three at a rate of times one. Ice three and bolt three are totally unique to Tritouch. And I'm gonna have Trixie start learning this right now since Twy is still learning Bahamut. But she'll be done very soon. Yeah, she'll be done by the time I'm through here, I think. Alrighty, so we got a hole here. An opening in the cliff. Whoa! It's a whole new area! My gosh! I'm gonna have to prepare for this. And we'll go through here next time on Let's Play My Little Pony Fantasy 6. Arrivederci!